Give me the energy for the collective, please. The energy for the collective. I have some very huge cards, guys. <laughs> I hope you guys are doing okay. I just switch up the music a little bit. Uh, I don't know if I'm going to keep this one because it's a little too... It's beautiful, but it's very... I don't know. Anyway. What's going on with the collective, please? What's going on with the collective? Innocence. Some of you want to go back to a time of innocence. You could be thinking about the past. Some of you guys are having memories of the past, or you could be worried about your innocence, right? So there's something about innocence that comes up. I feel like you guys are having memories of the past uh, where things weren't as complicated as maybe they are now. Sorry about that, guys. All right. So something about skin. What did I get? Innocence. I don't know why I'm feeling compassion, too. Something about compassion. I don't know if that came up in the... Because I really didn't pre-read these. Yeah, so innocence. You guys are worried about your innocence or something from the past collective. Give me more. Yeah, I see some of you guys are taking some sort of a mental break or, or coming out of one. I didn't pull the cards yet, but I have the four swords at the bottom of the deck. So some of you guys want to go back to a different time. So you might be retreating or taking a break from something. I want to go back to a more innocent time, less the drama. All right, we got one. We also have here patience. There's something that you guys, okay. Some of you guys are waiting to be found innocent. You're patiently waiting. Patience comes out upright. Or I want to go back to a time where things were simpler. A simple life. Remember that show? I love that show. Ciao. I love that show. I had a lot of shows I love. It was just, it was just a great, it was a great show. Ah. I wish it never went off. Matter of fact, I mean, you know, I'd love, to see, I'd love to see it come on again. That would be a whole nother, that would be so awesome to see how that goes out now. Oh my goodness. Okay. Give me more, please. What else is going on with the collective? Compassion. Yup. Okay. Comes out reverse. I told you guys when I, when I felt, I was like compassion. I don't know why that stuck out. Maybe you guys need to have more compassion as you wait with patience. That's a hard thing to do. Especially when a situation, you know, is a very particular situation. Maybe there's some folks involved here, right? Drinking coffee. When I look at this, the innocent part also reminds me of, you know, it's the past, the people that you loved. Maybe you need to be patient with these people. Maybe you need to have some sort of compassion, but innocence and patience. Give me one more, please. Why is compassionate reversed for the collective? Because somebody didn't use their intuition. I feel like they didn't use their intuition when it came to something. So I'm having some issues having compassion for whomever. I don't know if this is a person or a group. Give me more. Tell me what about intuition being reversed, please, for the collective? What's going on with that? Somebody didn't show any gratitude. They should have known to show gratitude. Ooh, somebody didn't show gratitude. I am curious, so give me one more, please. Give me innocence and patience. What's that about? Innocence and patience. Change. I don't want something to change. For some of you, you don't want your life to change, so you're trying to be patient, but you yet you have, feel like this has to do with other people or some poor decision that was made. Give me more, please. What is compassion and patience? What is the, What does the collective need to have compassion about? A reflection of the things that I'm remembering. There's something that you guys don't want to change, but you're reflecting on something that you just feel like I can't have any compassion for you. You guys are patiently waiting for something to change that hasn't changed yet in a situation. So I have patience that something is going to change. I want to go back to a more innocent time or I am innocent. I am innocent. I don't want things to change. I'm patiently waiting I cannot have compassion for people who did not use their intuition. And something about they that people are not showing people are not showing gratitude. You didn't show me any gratitude, says the collective. Give me more. Tell me compassion reverse and intuition reverse. What is this about? Playfulness. This, somebody's reflecting on something that was presented as a playful gesture, a joke. Somebody failed to use their intuition when they thought something was funny. 
they did something that was stupid when they were, I'm assuming, in a position where they should have been grateful or they didn't show any gratitude towards something or... I'm reflecting on a time where I assumed you were being playful, but you were serious about something. You didn't follow your intuition. Somebody did something that you thought was a joke collective, but they weren't playing. They really weren't playing. They did not use the intuition. They were not playing and they did not have any gratitude. There's also something about a union. This could have been about your relationship or a partnership. Somebody's reflecting on something about a union where there was nothing that was playful about it. For some of you here, I fear that something's going to change because I'm remembering something, something that was supposed to be fun, something that was supposed to be playful. It wasn't. It was about a union. Some union that we had. Give me one more. What about this union? What else is going on with this union? Beauty. For some of you, you feel like this was based on looks or something about looks. It was about beauty. It was about the way a union looked. It was beauty. It was my beauty. It was their beauty. It was the way something looked. It could have been about the way the couple itself presented itself. Like, what did you guys look like to the public, to friends, to family? Did you look perfect? Was it really perfect? There's something with beauty here. I, something's also, okay, so I want to go back to a time where things were more innocent. For some of you guys, whatever the situation is, maybe you feel like it took some sort of a toll on your looks here. Maybe some of you don't feel pretty or I fear not coming across or feeling beautiful anymore. Somebody could have an issue with ageism or getting older or whatever. I feel like somebody is realizing something about a union. Maybe somebody's realizing something wasn't about beauty maybe somebody pegged you wrong collective hmm. yeah somebody could have pegged you wrong you're innocent give me um really you're gonna put a commercial on hold on i usually don't get commercials on the other one so i guess i have to wait 16 more seconds beauty reverse please and change reflection clarify beauty well reflection yeah clarify please something with love oh Beauty. I understand that beauty is not all about or something with beauty being reversed in love. Maybe somebody's confused with beauty and love, something like that. Somebody might be confused. What is the difference? In some cases, it could be. I, I don't have to be beautiful to have love. There's something that somebody's reflecting on when it comes to love and beauty. My thoughts. I feel like somebody's having thoughts about past thoughts or this is something I don't want to think about but I need to reflect on beauty reverse understanding that it's not all about beauty not all about looks love is not right thoughts the way I thought of something before maybe I didn't take it seriously maybe I was playing with something I didn't follow my intuition when I played with something now I'm thinking about it it's love something about beauty I fear some sort of change I'm reflecting on it Give me more. Tell me playfulness and union. This had to do with the relationship, definitely. Give me more. Power. Somebody feels like they don't have any power over anything. I don't have any power over my thoughts. I don't have any power over this union. Somebody felt powerless in a relationship. And somebody thought they were running the show. With the jokes. With the selecting people for the wrong reasons or something like that, divine timing. Divine timing is not, this is not working for you. There's no divine timing in this. If you guys gave up this union or somebody played with a union, I don't know if this person is trying to come back, but I consistently keep getting a message that somebody is thinking about the past. Maybe they're thinking about the conversations had, right? Maybe there was a time when this person should have been playful or should have entertained you and also playful conversations. It looks like they went for the the opposite, right? I want the hardcore, you know, kick you back in every time I argue with you type of nonsense, right? For somebody, maybe, maybe you guys weren't the most beautiful people in the world. And I feel like this person now realizes what love is. They're trying to be patient, but they know something changed. I also feel like whoever they ended up with, this person no longer, they understand that that's not it. This beautiful person, even though they're beautiful, they're nasty. Hmm. 
What about divine timing and beauty? Hope. Somebody wants to have some sort of hope now. I now have hope and love. I understand looks is not about... It's not everything. Give me more. Give me thoughts reversed in love. I think somebody had a skewed perception of what love is and what it was supposed to stand for. Guardian angel. Hope. Guardian angel. Thoughts. Love. Thoughts. Somebody's hoping that a guardian angel helps him out. On ways... To turn a certain behavior around and follow their intuition. How do I turn something around and follow my intuition? Somebody knows that they did not show gratitude in a union. They understand. I feel like now this person is powerless. They, they feel like divine timing is against them. Like there's no divine timing. Somebody feels like they can't, I guess, get you back or change the dynamic of this union. Give me more. Guardian angel grace somebody knows that they're not going to get any grace somebody's hoping that they get grace or even i guess dealing with a guardian angel or really focused on one it says there's no grace somebody doesn't get any grace they may have had some bad thoughts about you this person's powerless because they were they did not they weren't playful with you i feel like this person may have been nasty evil unkind give me one more First of all, this person is stuck. I feel like somebody wanted to play a little bit with you and then take off. Maybe they wanted to go to Paris or another country. It says that their adventure has been stalled. So there's no divine timing for this person, whoever this is. Somebody who you need to have compassion on. They're in your energy. This person is praying and hoping for some sort of grace. The grace could be so that they can go somewhere, travel somewhere, or they know that they're not going to have any adventure. That means there's no fun anymore. I feel like this person played enough and their party is over here. I don't know. Let's see what comes up. Ooh, excuse me. This had to do with the love relationship. Some of you guys could have been dealing with a Gemini, right? So we have that energy coming up. Give me more. This is somebody that you guys were in love with, tandem with. This also could have been a business partnership, right? Something where you guys were balanced. You were in love with this person, right? But I feel like for some of you guys, if I have to take a look, some of you may have had to, maybe some of you were dealing with an insecure person because I feel like you suppressed your beauty. You shouldn't have to do that. I'm not saying you have to be fly every day, but it's almost like you literally suppressed your beauty. Some of you dressed down to do something or help somebody's ego out. Ace of Wands here comes up too. This was a new romantic relationship, so this was fairly new for you guys. And I feel like maybe you dumbed down who you are, played down who you are. For some of you guys, this could have been somebody at work, somebody that you met at work, or maybe you met this person on a project, but it was a new romance. This could have happened on a job. You could be Aries, a Leo, or Sagittarius, all right? We also have here the Hermit. Mm, somebody went within for clarity. Or give me one more because somebody could have had a choice or there could have been a lover who you met at work who went into hermit mode maybe they disappeared all right maybe you're questioning this person with this hermit right maybe you're looking for some sort of truth about this person because they do show up in your energy as somebody you have to literally have compassion to forgive as you wait for the results of something that they did. So I feel like it's a process of finagling or balancing compassion and still waiting to get the results of whatever this person did. Somebody could have did something. It could have been a Gemini and a Virgo that got together, created some sort of an idea here with the Ace of Wands. Somebody could have created some sort of an idea. Uh, these two people could have gotten together romantically, right? Maybe that's something you have to have compassion about. It was a Gemini in a Virgo, maybe they have some business together. Give me more. What else? Eight of wow. Eight of swords. Somebody could have some. Maybe you're isolated from these people, or these people are isolated. For some of you, there is a Gemini who could be isolated because they're being probed under some sort of investigation, or they could be a Gemini in a, a Virgo. 
who came up with some sort of plan here. This is a plan. Somebody came up with some sort of plan. It could have been these two signs here, and it looks like they get locked up for it. It's something that they did, and it looks like it doesn't go well. Or these people are both in their heads, but it says isolation and imprisonment. So you guys could have a Gemini going to jail over an idea or something that they participated in. Or for some of you guys, it could be both these people getting locked up, a Libra, Aquarius, or a Gemini. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius shows up, but the two major arcanas here or signs is going to be a Gemini, going to be a Virgo. Why are these people getting locked up here? Because this is what I'm talking about. Y'all got more stuff to find out as you go along and attempt to have compassion for these people. It was something that they tried to do here, right? They weren't able to finish something. Somebody may have gotten caught. But this is, if you guys are, there's something that happened online. Something with the World Wide Web could have happened online with the Gemini. Maybe they released something about you. Whatever that's about. Maybe there's something that can't be finished. For some of you guys, they made it so you can't travel. I wouldn't know. I haven't tried. But being that I ain't done nothing, if I go over there with my passport and stuff, I shouldn't have any issues. Right? Or maybe I do. I don't know. I ain't left the house. So... And on top of that, one thing I am secure in, in is that, um, you know, we do have cameras all over the place, right? So people know what the paycheck look like when you're at work, like GPS, they have all those things. So I'm happy with that. But are people going to admit that that was actually used? And are they going to admit that there may have been some or absolute corruption involved? Like, are you willing to admit that? I mean, you got no choice. So somebody did something online. You could have a Gemini work with a group of people. Uh, these people could have gotten together or maybe they had some assistance from somebody. It could have been a Scorpio, a Leo, a Taurus, an Aquarius that helped them with this grand idea or urge to create, right? They may have even had somebody put under investigation here with this Hermit card because the Hermit card is a card of corruption. So you, had a, you could have had a Gemini that was being corrupt because this hermit card is corruption, but it is also the card of probing, looking into something, investigating, finding out the truth about a situation. If I look at it in layman's terms, somebody tried to get somebody arrested. It could have been a Gemini who came up with an idea to have somebody looked at, probed, or accused of corruption, set up for corruption of some sort, right? And put in jail. I could look at it that way. Or I could say these two people work together with an idea and they both go into jail. Something that was done online. What was done on the World Wide Web? Something about a cyber crime. Somebody can't travel. You might be in the public eye. You could be a performer. This Gemini tried to stop your money to moon. They didn't want you to know about this. Some of you guys could have gone to an airport or you were on your way and you could be on some watch list. You don't know because the moon comes out. That's something that you didn't see. Unseen problems, right? unseen problems in some cases somebody changes something on their own i get out of this on my own but according to the story here is something that you don't see that's online something could be online about you guys it was put there by a gemini it was also put there by a virgo four of wands it was something about a celebration there could have been a wedding a celebration you could have had a virgo put a celebration online Something about a celebration, a wedding, a reunion with a Virgo, or Aries, a Leo, a Sagittarius. Some of you guys here, there was a Pisces and there was a Virgo. They got together at a celebration or a reunion. This could have been anywhere, another country could have been at. It looks like it could be a wedding venue, right? So these people could have got married. Whatever happens here with this Pisces and this Virgo, it lands them in jail. Or at least some sort of, this person is caged. So based off what I see with this card, this is somebody going to jail. Somebody could have left the country here, which is why I have an adventure that went wrong. I have a celebration. I have an adventure that went wrong, right? Something went wrong. Again, it lands on the Eight of Swords. Somebody's either thinking about this really heavy or somebody is going to jail. Somebody could currently be imprisoned. Mm -hmm. More, tell me about the celebration had by these people. This Gemini attended, right? This Gemini attended, there were a group of people there. There was a Pisces there, there was a Virgo there. What's going on here? We got one that fell. Let me see what it is, this card. Hold on, Page of Cups, right? So this is gonna be about something with the birth of a child. Something with the birth of a child. It could be a new relationship because this whole thing says it's like a new relationship. So this was something that was very new. 
but it also says that somebody could have done something out of some sort of immaturity. For some of you guys, you may have had issues before, right? Somebody who could be younger in this relationship was immature. Let me say that. This also says not only is somebody immature, but there's now a breakup. Somebody has some sort of a celebration and now there's a breakup. There was an adventure taken, a trip taken with the four of wands. This suggests that this celebration was held elsewhere. Adventure reversed, right? Or it was supposed to be, or it went wrong. When I look at these cards, it tells me a celebration was held elsewhere. And whatever happened there with this page of cups reversed, it either gave birth to a child or something like that. Or this was a new relationship that is now broken up. So people may not be together anymore after this celebration or this celebration went wrong based off immaturity. It created some sort of breakup. Divine timing is reversed. What's this? Temperance. Whatever happened here, somebody literally is losing their mind over somebody. Somebody could be a king of cups. This could be over a water sign, a cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. The temperance is coming out reversed here. So this divine timing not going in this person's favor literally they're losing their mind they're off balance right now they don't know what to do they're very disruptive a temperance reverse is going to be a person who disrupts the flow of things right so they're disruptive they're chaotic they're excessive and whatever it is that they're doing it's always too much of it i need more of this i need more of this or i need more of that it's very excessive like it's almost like it's out of control so there's a great imbalance here because divine timing wasn't at work in some union that somebody went into. Maybe they went into it too fast and now they feel like a caged whatever. But whatever happens here, it feels like they actually get locked up. Why do we have the Eight of Swords here about this union? Why is the Eight of Swords showing up? Oh, that was so ugly. Oh, this deck, because I really, I really like this deck. It's just really, kind. it's kind of fancy, so I don't use it all the time. What is the name of this deck? Um, mystical moments. Yeah, I got the silver stuff. Temperance reverse here. What happened here? Give me temp. Well, yeah, give me the eight of swords. And I know they're losing their mind, but why? Why do we have the eight of swords upright and temperance reverse over a union? Tell me why, please. Nine of swords because there's something. And I this is really funny because I this was one of the when I was looking at the deck, I was like, what does that mean? Somebody's worried here. It could be a Libra, Aquarius, or a Gemini. In some cases, it's a Sagittarius here, right? You could be a Sag who's losing your mind because divine timing did not work in a union for you and you get to land in jail, right? So that's what you're afraid of. What you're afraid of, it says here, there are nine pair of eyes looking at you. It says that you're very afraid of people looking at you. There's something here where you guys are having these dreams, nightmares, can't sleep. For some of you, you are very depressed about this situation. It's a union that did not work out. Whatever happened here, you didn't get into a union in time. For some of you guys, this Nine of Swords is about this investigation. If I look at it this way, it's about this investigation, right? There's an investigation of somebody who could be a Virgo. There is corruption here because the Hermit card is corruption. Somebody could be investigating corruption. That means something that is illegal, something with wrong. It could be something with money. Somebody's investigating a celebration had somewhere where the relationship was short-lived. It could have been between a Virgo and a Pisces, but there's this Gemini energy that comes up. This Gemini was trying to hide this. This Gemini, either this Gemini didn't see something or it says the lover's card, which could be Gemini energy. Something was unseen to this person. Whoever presented to whatever, whoever presented something to this Gemini, it could have been a Virgo here. I feel like if there was a middleman, it could have been a Pisces between this Gemini and this Virgo. Somebody is the middleman. Somebody was a connect. Somebody was able to make this plan happen or the urge to create. I have the right people for you. We go to a celebration. And a celebration has to do with some sort of a union or something like that. But you end up, you end up some, okay, there was an adventure. So this trip had taken place elsewhere, right? This celebration, but the celebration went wrong. And there was some sort of breakup, some short-lived relationship or something like that. Because somebody was younger, there's now a breakup. Mm. 
I feel like somebody just might be sitting in a state of whatever here with this nine of swords. So the nine of swords is coming up. That tells us that there are some deep rooted issues, right? That need to be dealt with. First of all, this also tells me that you could be a Sagittarius or whoever you are on this board collective. Um, deep rooted issues. I feel like you feel like a ton of people are looking at you. I feel like you feel you're exposed. There's nightmares there's things coming out you don't want people to know or you definitely you can't sleep I don't feel like you've had a great night's sleep at all I feel like whatever this is it plagues you I feel like you guys are waiting for this to be over uh for some of you there's something where you might need to seek some sort of men men mental help here because it's a lot about depression too so this is very depressive energy I would call this mental illness definitely with the nine of swords people looking at me a bit of paranoia definitely something off imbalance tell me about this world card why is why why are you I, I see you losing your mind and I see your reaction to it but what is the actual crime why did you need to be saved the sun this might have had to do with your money for some of you guys you don't again you don't want something to come out the sun is illuminating you don't want something to come out the sun is about taking vacations which in your case probably are canceled I feel like that because you can't move you've been advised whoever you are or whatever you guys need to know this person's been advised that they can't move so this person could be somebody who's a big shot performer whatever they can't move their money is getting messed up the sun is about material abundance so their money's messed up they can't travel this is also exp extended trips in a sunnier place typically with children so there's a possibility this person may have wanted to have a vacation with their kids because i'm you know i don't want to i'm not going to paint some weird old picture of this one it just looks like they did some corrupt stuff but a page is a that's like a younger energy i don't know some of you guys could be younger than this person but this person was waiting for something miraculous to happen in a union a relationship there's been some impact on this person's money there's been some person some impact on this person's travel plans they can't do something for some reason they don't have the ability to do it right so i feel like whatever this is there's been delays for this person the delays could be temporary but they're still experiencing some sort of delays and I don't think this person expected any. They expected something. They expected whatever they were doing here. I don't know. I feel like they expected this celebration to pan out. Like, I just feel like maybe they wanted to have a good relationship and it just didn't pan out. It could be that simple. But I feel like there's a little bit more behind it. Uh-oh. Hold on, you all. I just think. All right. Tell me... Tell me, why is this energy here? So there could have been some interaction between a Leo and a Sagittarius with the Nine of Swords. Both these people could be worried. What are these people worried about? Or what is divine timing reversed about? What's that about? It's reversed because somebody doesn't have some balance. So there's a need for somebody to have balance. There's something where somebody was supposed to accumulate something in a certain period of time divine timing wasn't on their side somebody could have requested more time to do something this is about accumulation i feel like that might be a challenge uh preservation somebody could have been trying to hold on or keep what they have expenditure cheerfulness carelessness drive instinct and motivation i feel like time has run out for whatever these people or this person was trying to do with this union it looks like they need to have balance somebody was looking for loyalty this is what they were expecting, right? This is what they did not get. They didn't get the loyalty they expected. They didn't get the intelligence that they expected, right? So that's the information. They did not get the buy-in of the leaderships, the independence that they wanted, right? It also talks about lustfulness. So this is something else denied to them. Physicality, self, uh, self-reliance and mistrust. Huh. mistrust so if you look at it it's like it's some good and bad stuff up there but whatever they wanted it looks like they didn't get hold on y'all but i do want more this person whoever you are whoever this is there's something where divine timing didn't go in their way they could be a leo and it could be uh they could be a sagittarius whoever these people are they're losing money 
they're losing their ability to travel trips they're losing their minds they understand divine timing is not honest there's nothing happening divine with that what's what's being messed up with the divine timing i know it's the money i know it's the basically they lost their mind and they lost their money or whatever wealth they had they're down to two of pentacles these people are now juggling but they're still weighing options options about what what options are they weighing with this two of pentacles the seven of cups again it's confirmation that they're making choices about something in some cases this person could have commitment issues or these people have commitment issues they can't commit to their bills because they can't pay them but the seven of cups they're still looking at choices what choices are available to me in terms of what the seven of pentacles so this is them wanting a return on their investment so whoever this is they're still fighting to get whatever they want even though they know divine timing is not on their side these people are losing money losing their minds and it says they're still fighting they want their they want their return on investment i'm not suggesting that these folks are evil or nothing but i'm telling you they hid something and i'm telling you there was a celebration of reunion that had taken place across seas somewhere or because i keep seeing a glue this hermit card is a globe this adventure card is reversed and it's got paris on it some trip was further away it's far away from where you live we also have the world reverse they can't travel now but this tells me that this trip somebody had to take some a flight or it was a it was a trip like it was one of them ones that you had to fly or you had to drive like 24 hours 15 to 24 hours to get there for some of you guys it could have been if you have a, a if you have a neighboring country right near you possibility it could have been right in that neighboring country eight hours away a drive it was in another place could have been a colder climate i keep seeing something about the cold here and with this celebration although beautiful it strikes me very much as fall like early fall give me more something could have happened with an Aquarius you could be in a public eye they wanted their rate of return on an Aquarius or somebody in a public eye you like I said you could be a performer you could be in a public eye you could be an Aquarius this also means that they were hoping for something right they want hope they are, they want renewal they want a miracle and they know that I think the miracle part is challenge. I'm hoping for a miracle somebody's still having the strength this could be a Leo the sun actually let me go back the sun could be aries right so the sun could be aries strength is leo and we have temperance which is sagittarius i always still call leo i don't know i don't know why i do that but okay so somebody's still having strength somebody's still trying to balance something out right this could just be about this person's mental health um, they're trying to focus on their health too. Mental health, trying to take control of their confidence or gain confidence. Clarify the world reversed in the moon, please. The Nine of Pentacles. Somebody wants their wishes to come true. They did something. They put something online so that they could get the outcome that they wanted. They wanted the Nine of Pentacles, right? So they wanted that good health. They wanted material. They wanted it all. Somebody could have been hiding something from you. Gemini could have come to you. Maybe they found you online and they didn't want you to know what they were really there for, which is the Nine of Pentacles. Four of Wands. Somebody could have married too fast. This is a fast relationship. Six of Wands. By doing this, somebody was hoping that they could get some sort of reward or, you know, maybe they could live off your riches. They could be a boss with your Nine of Pentacles, right? They wanted to have some sort of business. They want to be a boss. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius could have connected with you for those reasons. Right? I want some recognition. You're going to help give me a name, something like that. You could be a Capricorn, Taurus, or a Virgo. Ace of Swords. For some of you guys here, I feel like this is clear to you because Ace of Swords is about thinking. It's about having a new revelation, having clarity on something, finally having a clarity on why somebody came in or what somebody's agenda is. You guys might understand what the agenda is or was of a Gemini lover. All right? With the two of swords coming out reverse so with this person they wanted to confuse you somebody that i just put it this way somebody that you were confused over you now have clarity over this two of swords some confusion about something i'm not sure i'm not i got an inkling that something's not right so the ace of swords your confusion ends right because what you were confused about or what you were thinking about is what is this person's agenda i feel like you guys know this person was there to confuse you or throw you off balance or something like that 
Why do I have the Eight of Swords here, though? The Two of Wands. Somebody wanted some fast results when it came for something. Or somebody's waiting for some results. Ooh. Some results. There's something with significant about a Pisces. Something about a Pisces coming up. It's because I keep seeing... I'm seeing the Pisces, but I also see Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. So it could have been... It could have been a Pisces and a, a fire sign. Something having to do with a roof. Something having to do with a house. Something fell apart. Something could have fallen apart with a Scorpio, right? Because I asked, well, what is this jail thing about? It's about something with arson property. Hold on. Arson property. In some cases, jail. Something ending, some sort of upheaval, the end of a job, a career. The Three of Pentacles. I said, what could they be going to jail for? We have the Three of Pentacles coming out reverse. This was some sloppy group work that somebody did. Somebody did something that had to do with office politics. So this probably had to do with your job, your home, something about the World Wide Web, something you weren't supposed to see. Three of Pentacles, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo. Somebody may have done something or somebody may have done something to a Scorpio here. With this group work that didn't work. Somebody wanted some fast results to make something fall apart or somebody have some trouble upheaval it could have been a Scorpio who they wanted these issues to happen to ten of pentacles they did this sloppy group work and efforts to get the ten of pentacles that's somebody's inheritance that's somebody's money inheritance legacy something that they're born into this also has to do with an older person not thinking that this person you the Scorpio here deserves it even though it's their money right so if they earned it you have this person here who still believes it's theirs uh, if you were born into it this person believes is theirs. Whoever this person is who believes it is theirs. I don't know who this person thinks they is, but you know, they feel like they something. But the group work turned out to be sloppy. So this this person, this older person who had this influence over folks with this day, the sloppy group work which they were involved in to get the Ten of Pentacles. It looks like it's coming out or it's been exposed because it says you go to jail over it. Capricorn, Taurus, or Virgo. We also have here Eight of Wands. Eight of Wands. I feel like for some of you guys here, because Eight of Wands is news speeding up. It's something about some fast, fast creativity. You give birth to something fast. Whatever this is, it slows down. Whatever this operation is, this sloppy group work to get the Ten of Pentacles, you start to slow it down. Because it would be a panic if it were upright. Somebody's moving fast. I want you to know somebody slows something down. I feel like because they know with this hermit card, they already know they're being looked at. So I feel like that's why that slowed down. Whatever happens here, somebody becomes frustrated. And that's when the travel, uh, the travel issues come in. Somebody could have even tried to run from this. But they ran into some travel troubles. You have the world reverse and you have eight of wands reverse. I can't move. I'm running into some troubles traveling. They know they can't move. I think somebody notified them. Yeah, they notified them of the creativity involved in something. Uh oh, hold on, commercial. Somebody notified them that there was some sort of creativity involved in making something happen with this group work. The magician card is about creativity. It is you reaching out to a group of people, contacts from the past to get something done. And I feel like that's what this person tried to do for whatever reason. This magician, it could have been a Virgo who could be the main player in this where there was sloppy group work. The communication starts to slow down. This is about inheritance. It's about money. It's about property inheritance. It's about somebody older being involved and having some sort of influence over a decision having to do with property. Somebody tried to burn somebody's house down too with that tower. This could have been about insurance fraud also. One of the main players is a Virgo. One of the main players is a Leo. A Gemini. It could be two Virgos. I have the Magician. The Magician card is actually Gemini and Virgo. So it's confirmation of those two. Or it could be two Virgos. It could be two Virgos, a Gemini. There's a lot of people. It's like mad people because then you got the World card. So this is like droves of people who put this thing together, the sloppy group work. At the direction, it looks like of a Virgo. The Virgo could also represent the government. This could be some government operation. Who knows? Uh, oops. Hold on. Sorry, y'all. Hold on. Let me see something now that I'm looking at it. Hold on. Um. Yeah, because remember, these are the people 
that you guys have to have compassion for as that's what they say you're supposed to have compassion it looks like you're not i'm not having compassion for you as you go through this or somebody didn't have compassion for you guys somebody didn't have gratitude i feel like you guys may have been good to these people too because gratitude is reversed what is this about why do i feel like this is very uh it feels very government related <laughs> especially with the magician here and the hermit give me the hermit mm -mm. hold on y'all first of all let me give these a good shuffle something about manipulation Ooh, my goodness. tell me about manipulation or i don't know why that keeps coming up Give me the uh give me the hermit. What were they looking at? What were they probing? Uh-oh, already got one. They were probing somebody's trauma. I feel like somebody have maybe investigating something to see how traumatized they are. Somebody wanted you guys traumatized. But it says here somebody was probing. Somebody could be looking at you. This could be a counselor. This could be the government looking to see how damaged you are. How much trauma did we place or how much damage did this group do? What else is this government people, the hermit? What are they looking at? Something may have happened at a hotel or a motel. They're they're evaluating something that happened at a hotel or a motel. The tra the effects of trauma. That's so weird. Some sort of trauma had the effects of jealousy. We're also evaluating jealousy. Huh. Evaluating a stranger who is jealous. The government is looking. Whoever this person is, the government's looking. They're looking at a parental figure. This parental figure could have been a stranger who caused you guys some sort of trauma. Something could have happened at a hotel or a motel. In some cases, some of you guys, there's somebody being probed for maybe this could be an abduction, a parental figure. Reverse. Somebody may not be your parent. They may have been a stranger. I don't know. All right. Oh, uh, what else do I need to clarify? Anything else here? Tell me about this lover, this person, this lover person, because the lover is upright. Feel so. This is somebody that you guys really were into. Give me one card for this lover. What is the connection, or what do we need to know about this person? This person did not want you to know that they were luring you. Like I'm giving you lollipop secretly. Like I'm seducing you secretly. I'm doing things behind the scenes secretly to make you think this or want that, right? Like they send people to you like that. I didn't want you to know I was luring you somewhere and I was doing it online. Somebody could have interrupted your online dating here with this world reverse. Like I said, they could have done something online, sent people your way. Somebody could have sent you guys a Gemini. What is going on with this world reverse? Give me one card, please. Accomplice partner in crime. It's a cyber crime, right? This cyber crime could have been done by a group of people. The fixed signs, I call them off. I think what I'm trying to say there is it really, it could be all the fixed signs, but it symbolizes a group of people, right? Working. Clarify. What else do I want to clarify here? There's something I want to clarify. What else do I want to clarify here? This a bench. No, I don't want that one. Give me the magician. No, give me the tower. Give me the tower. Give me the tower for the collective. A burial. Somebody wanted to get rid of your house or wherever you live or cause some sort of an accident so they could bury you. Now, remember, this also talks about insurance fraud, that card. The tower is arson. It's insurance fraud for a home, right? It's something about an insurance claim. It's also somebody facing some sort of ego death shame when something falls apart when this comes out. All right? Give me the magician, please. Give me the magician, please. One card. Transhumanism. They were trying to do some sort of magic. I'm not quite sure what that is. You can look it up. I don't know if they were trying to take human tendencies and whatever, whatever. I don't know. But they were doing something. Give me one more. What else with this Virgo? I'm not looking that up. Whatever they did, it was yep, a government-controlled operation. It was premeditated. Somebody could have been testing you. I told you this felt government-like. This magician here is a Virgo. And there's a Virgo who was doing something. It was premeditated what this person did. This person could this could be a government operation that you're not supposed to know about. This could be definitely something that was premeditated. 
I don't know if this Virgo works for the government or if this is the actual government. But when we looked at the government, right, the Virgo over there, we know that they're looking at a, a parental figure, a parent that did something out of jealousy, they hid something. There's a person that's at the top there. So this person could be looking down. Somebody, <laughs> excuse me, guys. Somebody could have tried to, um, get, I don't know. It looks like it's a child up there, a girl. Yeah, there's a little girl fishing up there or something like that. Somebody could have been trying to hide a kid. Because they have the motel thing up there, somebody could have abducted a kid. Premeditated. Heard of for hire. So, also, they tried to hire somebody to get rid of you. Give me the strength card. Tell me what's up. One card for strength. Intuition. Somebody's using their intuition to get through a situation. How do I finagle through terrible group work? <laughs> this person with this intuition is getting tarot card readers and stuff. So, whoever this is, if they told you, if this is, this is a Leo. So, if a Leo told you, this, read, this Leo is getting tarot readings. All right, so if they told you they're reading their Bible, the cards say here that they's getting their tarot readings, okay? Let's stop letting these folks fool you. Give me more. What's the intuition? What, what is the goal? What do they want? They want their relationship put back together or they want to destroy your relationship. How do I keep these people uncoupled? Intuition. How do I keep somebody uncoupled? Whoever this is, they don't want you together with somebody. This person, whoever they are, who does not want you to have a couple or a relationship, they're still, I told you, they're still working on this. These, this, they're still, this is probably a parent, they're still working on this. They sold their soul to the devil a long time ago. A long time ago. This could have been somebody who says they're of the church and they are not. No, oh, they're part of some church. This is not the church that we know. They're part of some other church. I don't know what church that is. Um, we also have here environmental hazard. They might be trying to play with your environment here because this eight of wands has somebody under a bunch of umbrellas. So there might be something with a solar storm and they're doing something around you, something electronic, who knows? Maybe there's toxic food around you. Now this is speaking more to environment, food shortages, toxic food. And this is supposed to be a top secret. So there's some top secret celebration on how to off somebody celebration, a top secret classified a couple of things here classified. Anyway, that's all I have for you guys. I want you guys to go. I love you. Thanks for tuning in to Zen Romance Tarot. Like, share, subscribe. Like, share, subscribe, please. Love you guys. Bye.